In this video, we'll take a look at ViewStats Pro, which is MrBeast's new YouTube tool. Now we'll take a look at the Pro version, which allows you to use all of the tools that MrBeast has used in the lifetime of him building his channels. That's not to get it confused with the free version of ViewStats, which simply allows you to track different data points of your YouTube channels and other people's channels, similar to something that Social Blade would offer. So I'm going to buy Pro Tools right now and we're going to have a first look together. So we'll go to Pro Tools where we can here learn more about what Pro Tools is and what is actually included. So if we scroll down, we can get to know Pro and here are the features that are included. So we've got here outlier videos where we can see what video performs much better compared to all of our other videos. We've also got video alerts so we can get notified every time a video topic is trending. And there are some other features as well, which we're gonna explore once we get started. So I'm gonna click get started now, which will take us to the payment page where we can go ahead and upgrade. I'll leave a link in the description if you wanna check view stats out at any point. Well, let's go ahead and upgrade and I'll show you what it's all about. So it is $49 per month. Or if you pay by the year, it's going to be $39 per month. I'm going to just pay for one month and we'll check it out. Okay, so after paying for that on the card, we have now been given access to the quick access section. And from here, we can choose what tool we want to use. So we'll take a look at alerts first. So if we go ahead and click on alerts, it's then going to welcome us to alerts and explain a bit about it. So what you can do, you can go ahead and set up alerts that include keywords, view count, limits, and more. And it's then gonna find videos which match your filters. And it means you can stay updated with different trends and different ideas, different content methods that are working right now. So if we click get started, we can then enter in some video titles and some keywords that we want to track. So let's say we have a tutorial channel and we wanna keep up to date with like AI videos. So let's just type in AI. We'll enter in also WordPress and we will also enter Hostinger. So once you've added them, go ahead and click next and you can get technical with your filters. Do you want to include or exclude words from video titles? I'm gonna just click next. And we're looking for long format videos of 10,000 plus views. And there you go. I'll just call this alert test. It's now gonna notify us of video topics and videos which match our filter. So we've got videos here about faceless kids animation. That could be a good tutorial video to make. You've got chatbots, how to turn off censorship on character AI. That could be a good tutorial to explore. So this tool could actually be very good for keyword research as well. I'm gonna have a better look at that later. Now moving on, we've got outliers. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. So if we click on outliers, we can go ahead and see outliers. And outliers are videos that have more views than all of the other videos on that same channel. And you can kind of like see different formats which work and what topics are getting a lot of views. You can toggle YouTube Shorts or YouTube. We can also go into filters here and filter for videos with over a certain amount of views or a high out uh, outlier score. Let's try searching by keywords. So let me just search WordPress. Okay, so here we go. These could actually be really helpful for my channel. And again, a great way to find videos to make. Moving on to thumbnail search, let's take a look at that. So we can now describe a thumbnail or paste in a YouTube URL. Now I am curious here, I'm gonna paste in one of my URLs and see if anyone's copied them. So here's my tutorial channel. We'll just go ahead and copy the link for this one and just kind of see what it comes up with. Okay, so it's giving us videos related to mine. Again, this is a really good way to find viral video ideas. This is actually a really strong tool. We've got Fiverr. It's just good for brainstorming and just kind of like getting video ideas and noting them down that you can create. And you can really, here's one of my thumbnails look as well. And you can really learn like kind of like what's getting views and what's hot right now. Like if you filter for newest, We've got here Canva tutorials, two hour long video. Canva tutorial for beginner. Pretty cool. A-B test, let's have a look and see what we can learn from here. So it's filtering by the most recent A-B tests. So we can just go ahead and click on these and see how many thumbnails they've tested. So in this case, it is eight thumbnails. 
and we can kind of flick through these and learn from each mistake. This is the current one, and this is the A-B testing ones. Kind of interesting how, like, in this one, you see the whole caravan in the shot. This one only shows a very small part of the caravan. I'm assuming this video is about them buying one of these static caravans. So yeah, it would make sense that the whole caravan in the shot would get more people to click on it. Pretty cool. You could probably learn a lot from A-B testing, just sitting down, analyzing data for hours. Then we've got collections. I'm not too sure what this is. We can make a new collection. Let me call it YouTube How To's. And we can, uh, and I guess we can add content into this and this can be our own collection. So overall, do I recommend ViewStats Pro? Well, the tool does look very powerful just from the first impressions. I'm gonna have a deeper look at it and really use it to generate some video ideas. And I'll come back with a more advanced tutorial once I know how to use it. And I'm going to put it to use and generate some video ideas. The tool is very good if you already have a base understanding of YouTube because you'll probably know how to apply the data on screen much easier than someone who has no idea at all. But yeah, if you want to learn more about YouTube, check out ViewStats Pro. Thank you, Mr. Beast.